What do you know about rheumatoid arthritis? RA, also RA, also known as rheumatoid arthritis, is a chronic inflammatory disease. It affects not just your joints, but body parts like your skin, eyes, lungs, and even your heart. It's classified as an autoimmune disorder, meaning your immune system, which is meant to protect you, mistakenly attacks your own body tissues. Consequently, this triggers inflammation, which subsequently cause damage to the system. It's an interesting paradox, how the system designed to safeguard, can sometimes turn against us. Rheumatoid arthritis is a complex disease, but understanding it is the first step towards managing it. Now that understand what rheumatoid arthritis is, let's delve deeper into its symptoms. How does one know they might have rheumatoid arthritis? There are mainly five significant signs that could indicate this disorder. First, tender, warm, swollen joints are often initial indications. You may notice a soft swelling over the joints of your hands, feet or knees. The second symptom is fatigue. It's not usual tiredness. Instead, it's an extreme exhaustion impacting your whole body, making simple tasks feel overwhelming. The third symptom is low-grade fever, often accompanied by loss of appetite and sweating. The fourth is weight loss due to the inflammatory response leading to appetite loss. The fifth symptom is stiffness, particularly in the mornings and after inactivity. This stiffness can persist for 30 minutes or more, often associated with a general feeling of discomfort. Over time, this condition may cause deformities in joints due to inflammation damaging joint tissues, leading to stretching, and ultimately changing the joint's shape and alignment. If you are experiencing these symptoms, pay attention as we discuss the potential causes of rheumatoid arthritis. What triggers rheumatoid arthritis in the first place? This mystery has intrigued the medical fraternity for a long time. Our comprehension of the illness has grown over time. Firstly, there's genetics, which play a major role. Certain genes can make you more susceptible to environmental triggers. Secondly, hormones could be involved, as women are more prone to this disease. Pregnancy, a high hormone phase, tends to alleviate symptoms in some cases. Environmental factors, specifically exposure to substances like asbestos or silica, and smoking, another potential cause, can increase the risk. Those at risk should consider quitting smoking. Lastly, certain infections may act as triggers, although research on this is ongoing. Understanding the causes is half the battle, but it's also important to know about the complications that rheumatoid arthritis can cause. We'll explore more about this in the next section. What happens if rheumatoid arthritis is left untreated? The outcomes can be grave and pave the way to assorted complications. Let's investigate five key ones. First, osteoporosis, a state that deteriorates bones making them fracture prone. Rheumatoid arthritis can amplify the osteoporosis risk, possibly due to inflammation or corticosteroids usage, a prevalent treatment. Secondly, rheumatoid nodules, firm lumps sprouting under the skin, often around pressure points. They're generally painless but indicate disease progression. Third, Sjogren's syndrome, dry eyes and mouth. It's triggered when the immune system inaccurately attacks tear and saliva glands, leading to discomfort and potential vision problems. Fourth, infections. The disease and medications used to counter it can debilitate the immune system, making it challenging to combat viruses and bacteria. Finally, lung disease. Some rheumatoid arthritis patients develop lung issues, including scarring and inflammation, culminating in breath shortness and severe conditions like pulmonary hypertension. These complications can be severe, but there are ways to prevent rheumatoid arthritis. As we further traverse this topic, we'll examine preventative steps and remedies that can aid in managing this intricate disease. Can we prevent rheumatoid arthritis? This question is common. While we can't fully prevent it, we can certainly mitigate the risk. Firstly, maintain a healthy weight. Extra weight can stress your joints, potentially triggering rheumatoid arthritis. So watch the scale. Secondly, exercise regularly. It assists in weight management, keeps joints flexible, and strengthens muscles. It's not about marathons, even a brisk walk helps. Thirdly, if you smoke, quit. Smoking is tied to a higher rheumatoid arthritis risk and worsens symptoms if you have it. 
So quit for good. Fourthly, a healthy diet is necessary. Foods rich in omega-3 fatty acids like fish, walnuts and flax seeds, help counter inflammation. Fruits and veggies, loaded with antioxidants, also fight inflammation. Lastly, regular checkups help detect early signs of rheumatoid arthritis. Early detection is vital for disease management and lessening its impact. While prevention is key, there are also treatments for those who have rheumatoid arthritis. Don't lose hope. Through correct measures, we can lead healthier lives. How can rheumatoid arthritis be treated? This question is an everyday reality for many living with this chronic ailment. Let's simplify the five primary treatment strategies. Medication is the initial line of defense. Non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs NSAIDs, corticosteroids, disease-modifying anti-rheumatic drugs DMARDs, and biologic agents all play a pivotal role in reducing inflammation and slowing disease progression. The next vital approach, physical therapy, incorporates a structured program designed to maintain joint flexibility, fortify strength and improve function. For those whose conditions defy medication and therapy, surgery might be a viable option. Procedures synovectomy, tendon repair or joint replacement can alleviate pain and restore function. Additionally, lifestyle modifications such as regular exercise, balanced diet, adequate rest and stress management are integral to managing rheumatoid arthritis. It's an encompassing approach that extends beyond symptom treatment, promoting overall health. Lastly, alternative medicine, which includes practices like, like acupuncture, yoga, tai chi and meditation, may offer supplementary relief alongside conventional treatments. Despite continuing research, many find these methods beneficial. To summarize, the five treatment strategies are medications, physical therapy, surgery, lifestyle modifications, and alternative medicine. Rheumatoid arthritis is a complex disease that necessitates individualized treatment plans. A collaborative effort with a healthcare team ensures an effective strategy. Rheumatoid arthritis, a complex disease, but with the right knowledge and care, it can be managed effectively. Rheumatoid arthritis, a chronic condition, but not one without hope. We've explored its defining factors, symptoms, origins, potential impacts, and precautionary steps. We've examined multiple treatment methods. These facts arm you in fighting this condition. This understanding makes managing rheumatoid arthritis less intimidating, more achievable. Remember, knowledge is power and understanding. Rheumatoid arthritis is the first step towards managing it.